Police are now questioning locals as to whether they know a Kenneth Coombs as they continue their forensic investigations after the grim discovery at the semi-detached property in Reddish. The 63-year-old, named locally as mum of one Barbara Coombs, is alleged to have told police the killing happened several years ago, with it understood cops are now focusing on the years 2004 and 2005. Barbara's daughter Isley, 29, was yesterday too upset to comment. Neighbors have since spoken out of their shock at the discovery of human remains at the home on Matlock Road, with forensic officers descending on the scene. Shock neighbor Ann Miller, 73, said, she is a lovely woman who has lived in that house for years with her dad and daughter. She never gave any impression she had a dark past, and I can't believe she would be capable of something like this. The identity of the body has not yet been confirmed. Evidence tents were erected at the back of the house, and it is understood 18 bins were delivered to the property at the request of officers. I cannot believe it. She is such a lovely person. I have known her for many, many years. She lived with her mum and dad, and her mum died many, many years ago. I just assumed her dad died many years ago. I used to chat to her as I was walking down the road. I just cannot believe what I am hearing. She is a very quiet and reserved person. Detective Inspector Dan Clegg from GMP's major incident team said, We will continue our work at the scene through the night and hope in the coming days we can piece together the exact circumstances surrounding the man's death. Officers immediately launched an investigation and today, Tuesday 9 January, a scene has been established in the garden. At this time, a body has not been found, but enquiries are ongoing, and the man's family, who are being supported by specially trained officers, have been informed. A 63-year-old woman has been arrested on suspicion of murder and remains in custody for questioning. Do you have a story for The Sun online news team? Email us at tips at thesun.co.uk or call 0207 782